Hi, good. My name is Greg Moore. I was having some abdominal pain and I thought I was having an appendicitis attack. Typical male, I let it uh, go a little bit longer. I started having the pain about one o'clock in the afternoon and didn't go to the emergency room until 10 o'clock at night when uh, it was really bad. Showed up at the emergency room. They asked me what the pain level was between one and 10 and I said about 15. Based on his clinical exam, imaging findings and lab findings, he had perforated sigmoid diverticulitis. So it was uh, a little bit more severe, I guess, than just an appendicitis attack. So this is generally the colon. He uh, did a really good job explaining what he had done, what was going to happen over the course of the next two to four weeks. There's small intestine all around in the other part of the abdomen. We brought a loop of small intestine out through this right side so that this could heal while the infection was clearing and everything went great. So I wore a colostomy bag for about four weeks. I'm glad I made the decision to, to come in and get it taken care of. He was very motivated and did everything he could to, to put himself in a position to get out of the hospital quicker and recover faster and it makes a big difference. He was like, you're good to go. You can eat whatever you want and, and travel and do what you do for your job and no restrictions, so it's worked out well. I can tell right away, you know, he cares about the patients, wants the best for them. So I appreciate everything the doctor and his staff did. I think that goes a long way towards the healing process. You need to be good and skilled at what you do, but if you're good and skilled at what you do and you don't treat that patient as if they were someone that you care deeply about, you've only got half the equation right.